Pegi 18. This is Rabbi Ray Rana and you're listening to Radio Freaky Rat. Let's hear some tunes. OMG, Ajay Gale. I have been keeping an eye on you. You are doing really good work. I know everything about everything that's going down around here. These days, things are getting so crazy. Kirat's got so much stuff to see, terrains to explore, people to meet, animals to hunt, wrongs to right, and trippy sacred realms to explore that you could live here forever, literally, and still discover more. It's kind of ironic that you're back, right? I mean, after your dad died, your mom took you to the States to keep you away from all this chaos. Now you've landed in the middle of civil war. Your mom knew this would happen if she sent you here to scatter her ashes. Mother knows best. Reclaiming Kirat will be no slice of cake, as you guys say. Pagan Min and his really mean army of cool-looking thugs are just crazy. No one ever teach you that it's rude to text at the table. Knock out his legs by taking out his regional lieutenants and destroying the propaganda towers and outposts. Radio waves are the key to power around here. Trust me, in the lowlands you'll find Paul Deplore, the army's chief interrogator. You're a golden hat, a terrorist, bad guy. Pagan Min's vice lord, Noor Najjar, is in charge of the deadly drug trade in the woodsy Midlands and the bloody battles in the notorious Shanat Arena. Some people believe you can make a difference here. This is the moment of truth. The battle continues! Ah, above all the chaos, the Himalayas are controlled by Yuma. She's a real ice queen and warden of Durgesh, Pagan Min's mountain top prison. I apologize for the Spartan accommodations, but you have been a naughty little shit, haven't you? Everything is deadly up here. All kinds of bad guys and critters. And super slippery ice. So look alive if you want to stay alive, okay, bud? Welcome to Banapur, home of the Golden Path. The peaceful people of Kirat need your help. Thank you. Join up with the leaders of the crusade against pagan men. Sabal is a traditionalist and a lifelong rebel. I knew your father, and I respected his vision. And Amita is trying to push Kirat into the 21st century. Kirat can't survive if Sabal keeps clinging to the past. Okay, real talk, Ajay. To stand a chance against the much larger royal army, you gotta fight crazy with crazy, and you're gonna have to go full-on guerrilla style. The meek shall inherit the earth, my friend. All they need are some good guns. Try throwing knives or the autocross to hit them before they even know what hit them. Or if you want to be a one-man army, try the new MG42. Elephant gun, mortar. <laughs> or you can get creative with your M79 grenade launcher. It's all about the element of surprise, my man. Flaming cars, tiger bait. Switch it up to keep them guessing how they'll die. When the going gets tough, get going fast. The people will totally donate their cars, dune buggies, jet skis, tuk-tuks, snowmobiles, and hovercrafts. The Royal Army will lend you the military vehicles too, if you know how to ask. Every vehicle is a weapon. Strap C4 onto it and let it ride into an enemy base. The living world of Kirat is a sight for soaring eyes. Watch all the crazy shit unfold below from the comfort of the gyrocopter. True victory takes raw instinct and killer skills. Skin your clothes. We can always use the belt. There are multiple paths to choose from. Follow the path of the elephant to become stronger, tougher, and more resistant to enemy attacks. The path of the tiger makes you faster and quieter and teaches you brutal takedowns. 
learn to live off the land by crafting plants for drugs and remedies, or turn animal hides into cool gear like new holsters to back more heat. You're a tough man to kill, brother. Shangri-La. Shangri-La. <laughs> now there's one region that's out of this world, like it's literally outside of our space and time. It's called Shangri-La, and it's a window into Kirat's ancient legendary past. It is a total trip. Like the rest of Kirat, it's under siege by evil invaders, and it's up to you to restore peace to this lost paradise. Local life trudges on despite the war. Go on adventures with the locals like ancient treasure hunting. You're going to be a star. Making adventure films. And the ultimate pastime, shopping. We're gonna make you look fierce. Don't be shy, man. If Pagan Min gets too tough, invite anybody to lend a hand or a gun as your pal Herc. You and me, man. New and improved tat bros. That's right, living the dream. Come on, punch it in. From starting your own air force to wreaking havoc across the country, all of Kirat is open for the both of you. I'm the cavalry, man. I was gonna roll them here like goddamn Clint Eastwood. If you don't have any friends, hire some. Mercenaries operate on the honor system. You help them, and they'll help you back. We never leave a friend in danger. With friends like these, who needs enemies? Or pick a side for adversarial matches. For the people! The royal army's spiritual force, the Rakshasa, have the ability to summon deadly beasts. You swarm and blink arrows and disappear into thin air. However, the local rebels of the Golden Path Ready when you are. use modern weapons like machine guns and artillery to take control by brute force. Alright, my man, I gotta get back on the airwaves and you gotta get out there and save Kirat. Now, whether you think this place is a paradise, a war-torn nightmare, a crazy vision quest, or a shooting gallery, you won't truly find what you seek until you find yourself in Kirat. Or something. Stay safe and don't touch that dial, you hear me?